All right, what's up guys? Um, today I'm gonna do something different for my channel. It doesn't involve movies. Um, kinda got inspired to do this a little bit from Beyond the Realms, doing his uh, vinyl collection and everything. I don't own any vinyl, but um, I went and got my CDs out of storage today. And uh, mainly because I lost all my music that was on my old computer and wanna re-download a lot of this to computer that I have now and uh, of course I lost all the other stuff that I didn't own the uh, CDs of just downloaded but um no big deal um don't really listen to a, a lot of music anymore but every now and then I feel the urge to listen to certain uh shit uh, but um <clears throat> so anyway I'm gonna go through these pretty quick I'm not gonna sit here and name like all the song, song titles or anything <clears throat> and I know I'm gonna get shit for some of these but, um, yeah, just thought I'd share with you guys as I unbox these. I kind of forget what's in these myself. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. If you guys uh, have any of these albums or um, anything, feel free to comment or are curious of uh, if any of them are any good or anything. Just uh, feel free to ask in the comment section. So, like I said, I'm going to go through these just pretty quick. And start with these four that were in my car and uh first one is and these aren't in any kind of order guys i just pulled them out of the box and just threw them up on this table and i got a whole nother box to get through after this section so looks like most of this first box is mainly uh like older rap and like uh psychopathic record stuff you know icp twisted all that kind of crap but um so first one is Twisted Ambitions <clears throat> Got this at Half Price Books for two bucks and I actually really like this album. So It was a good uh, pickup for two bucks This one here. I got for free at a convention when I had a uh, Ari Lyman uh, sign my poster. This is a uh, First Jason Ari Lyman's group. It's uh, it's not very good <laughs> And he signed it here on the back Jason one Ari Lyman but, um, yeah, it is a nice little, you know, something extra. So, if you guys like, uh, 80s, uh, metal or whatever, then you might like this, but I didn't really care for it. Next, we got the old, uh, Snoop Dogg, Doggy Style. Here. Just, you know, classic gangster rap, you know, from back in the day. And this is probably the, the newest CD that I've purchased. This is a uh, AWOL Nation's Run. Very, very good album. If you guys haven't checked this whole album out, I highly recommend picking this up. Alright, we got, uh, I'm kind of opening them because I think some of these got like doubled up with other CDs. So I might as well check them while I'm going through them. We got ABK, Hatchet Warrior. Pretty uh, decent album there. Then we got ICP Ringmaster, you know, one of their early ones. Then we got ICP Tunnel Love, you know, Insane Clown Posse for those that don't know who ICP is. Then we got the Amazing Jekyll Brothers, or ICP. A lot of ICP stuff in here. Then we got The Great Malenko, another ICP. Got one of my favorite albums of all time. That's Rage Against the Machine, self-titled. <clears throat> awesome, awesome album. Tom Morello is just awesome guitar player. Ah, there it is. I was looking for that. See, I found one. Then we got the first Twisted album I ever bought. I didn't even know who they were when I bought this and loved it. That's a... Uh, Twisted, Most Tasteless. All these ICP related albums I know I bought brand new when they first come out. So a lot of the stuff I've just had for so long and as a collector I just can't get rid of physical media. We got the double album here from Twisted. That's Man's Myth Volume 1. I guess it's, I don't think it was a double album. I think one was a yeah, this one's a bonus feature DVD with it. 
We got a Rage Against the Machine Renegades. Another uh, pretty good album. I believe this was mostly uh, cover songs. We got uh, Three Doors Down, The Better Life. Very good album. Alright, so like I said, some of this I'm going to get shit for. But hey, it was popular when it came out. Everybody that was a teenager when this shit came out, you know, had it. I don't even want to hear it. It's a uh, Limp Biscuit, Chocolate Starfish, and a Hot Dog Flavored Water. We got Rage Against the Machine, Battle of Los Angeles. Another really good album. Yeah, Black Sabbath. We sold our soul for rock and roll. So it has a few, you know, uh, the Black Sabbath song, uh, War Pigs, Iron Man, stuff like that. <clears throat> and we got Beck, Mellow Gold. Great album from Beck. And uh, Limp Biscuit. $3 bill, y'all. And we got <clears throat> Family Values Tour 98 with uh, Limp Biscuit, Corn, Orgy, Romstein, Ice Cube, Incubus. I, I still love this album. I don't care. Then we got a live album here from Rage Against the Machine live at the Grand Olympic Auditorium. We have a soundtrack here from Not Another Teen Movie. Pretty much just bought this for Manson's uh, version of Tainted Love. It's a great, uh, um, oh, what do you call it? It's not a remake. That's what you said. It's a movie. A cover. I'm sorry. A uh, cover song there from uh, Manson. Another great album here. It's a Perfect Circle, Near De Noms. Still had the uh, in there. Another soundtrack here. It's Resident Evil's Apocalypse. I pretty much bought this one for um, uh, Slipknot's on here and uh, some Rob Zombie and Deftones and Cradle of Filth uh, and some Romstein on there. I don't know if you guys can even see or even care. And we got a uh, Godsmack. Faceless. Pretty decent album there. Yay! More than a biscuit. Significant other. We got a great album here from Soulfly. Opens up and everything. Double. Double album. It's just uh, self titled. We got the classic ACDC, Back in Black. Everybody knows that. We got another classic ACDC, Razor's Edge. Sorry, I don't remember some of these. Stained, 14 Shades of Grey. Better than 50 Shades of Grey, right? Don't look at me like that. Uh, and then we got... Uh, Mud vein, beginning of all things to end. Sorry, I don't remember some of these uh, album titles. It's been so long. Then we got White Zombie, Devil Music Volume One. We got ICP's Bazaar. Cool cover. We got Psychopathic Riders. Check your shit in, bitch. Got some LSG here. Got 3 6 Choices album. 3 6 Mafia. We got Twista, The Day After. Got a Trick Daddy, Thug Matrimony. Oh, I apologize for the glare, guys. You know, these cases are. We got 3 6 presents to Head Buses. 
I saw what happened to him. We got Jay Z, Volume 3, Life and Times of Sean Carter. We got Triple Six, Club Memphis Underground, Volume 2. That glare is terrible. We got Crazy Bone, Thug Mentality, 1999. Awesome, awesome album here. I used to listen to this all the time and just, you know, chill in the car. So, we got a. Sir Mix a lot, Mac Daddy. You all know this is only good for like one song. We got Tupac, Greatest Hits, double album. Tupac and the Outlaws, not very good. Tupac's Thug Life. Triple Six Underground Volume 1. Got Ice Cube, The Predator. The uh, classic, uh, I think that was on here. I'll make sure before I say, yeah, it was a good day. Today was a good day. We got a uh, Rex in effect, hard or smooth. With the old, uh, shit, can't think of it. Yeah, rump shaker. Drawing blanks. Got some too short, getting where you fit in. I was big on two short, three six, you know, all that stuff. No limit. Speaking of which, Silk the Shocker, first album. Could be wrong on that, don't quote me. Bone Thugs and Harmony. The Resurrection. Three six, Crazy in the Last Days, probably their most popular album. You know, lots, of, lots of good songs on here. We got a Stone Sour. Uh, I believe it's self titled. With, uh, you know, the, the hit on here was, uh, oh, what was it? Oh, Bother. Yeah. Whatever. But good album, though. Got the old uh, Ghetto Dope Master P. No cover to this, but it's a uh, true crime family double album. And we got Master P, Only Guy Can Judge Me. That's one Man, these are old. 504 Boys, Goodfellas. No Limit, Presents Mean Green. It's a collaboration album. Just a bunch of different people on her. We got a, some Esham, Acid Rain. It's a good album as well. We got Madrox, Fatso. You know Madrox from uh, Twisted. We got Nelly's first album. Just bumped the shit out of this. It's Country Grammar. We got some KMFDM, Light. I wanted to try to find a bunch of their stuff. I used to have more, but uh, no back to this or anything. But I do have the real CD in there. This is Bush Razor Blade Suitcase. I know I got the case of this somewhere. But that's uh, two short cocktails. I just pulled these out of the box, guys, and I don't even know what's going on. R. Kelly, 12 play. We got Stain's first album. It's Function. Awesome, awesome album. Smashing Pumpkins, Siamese Dream. I believe this is uh, Red Zeppelin 4, if I'm, if I'm correct. Great, great album. We got a uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers. By the way, another ICP here. It's a Carnival Carnage. Psychopathics from Outer Space Part Two. ICP's Terror Will. This is ICP Forgotten Freshness. 
volumes one and two. There's a lot to go through here, guys. So, dirty Deeds, Done Dirt, Cheap, ACDC. It was just a classic rock uh, compilation. Got one of my other all-time favorite albums. Listened to this a lot growing up as a teenager. It's uh, Smashing Pumpkins, Melly Collie, and the Infinite Sadness. Great, great album here. I say album, but you know, CD, whatever. And hey, the case to Freak Show Twisted. Don't have the cover because uh, it had a nice fold-out poster on the inside, and I had them sign it at a Days of the Dead convention. I ended up giving it to my brother-in-law that really loves them more than I do. I mean, I'm still a big fan of theirs, but you know, I wanted to do something nice for him, so I let him have that. And we've got uh, no real case to this, but it's Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon, classic album. We got Rob Zombie, Educated Horses, not his best, but still decent. Mudvayne, Lost and Found. We got Stain, Chapter Five. Got band that I think is kind of underrated. I I enjoy this case is falling apart. But I hated these cases. This is a Mushroom Head. It's just XX. More psychopathic it's from Outer Space Part 3. These are just like compilation albums from people on Psychopathic Records at the time. We got another uh, ABK, Road Fools. Not only a few songs on here, but I like this this whole thing. Only like six tracks. We got uh, Dope, Felons and Revolutionaries. Picked this up at a Target that closed down years and years and years ago. I don't even know who they were. I just thought the album looked cool, you know, on the back and stuff. I love this fucking CD. It, it's awesome. And Dope became one of my favorite bands after that. And we got Static X, Wisconsin Death Trip. Great, great CD there. I'll try to quit saying the album. And then we got Mudvayne, The End of All Things to Come. I don't know if you can even see the album cover, but uh. Awesome album. Sorry, I can't. Uh, and then we got another perfect circle. Emotive. It, this is another great uh, CD to have. If you guys haven't checked this out, it's got a particular. We got Incubus, Morning View. Another great CD. We got Fuel, Something Like Human. Another good one. Master P, Ice Cream Man. Just old school shit, man. Mystical, Unpredictable. His best album. Uh, I keep going back and forth. We got Master P, 99 Ways to Die. Got some Beastie Boys, Solid Gold Hits. Limited edition DVD containing videos for all 15 songs as well there. Twisted Cryptic Collection, Volume 3. White Zombie, uh, Astro Creek 2000. Another Rob Zombie here, Past, Present, and Future. I, I got the DVD to it still. This is another thing. I, was, I watched the uh, videos and stuff. It's got a cool little booklet to it. And this is a real CD as well. This is a. Uh, Nine Inch Nails had like a whole like different versions of the uh, the track, and this is I believe this is 311, uh, just their first self-titled album, and uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers, Blood Sugar, Sex Magic, All right, something like that, Trick Daddy, Book of Thugs, waste too much time, Ludacris. Disturbing the Peace, Thug.com, Trick Daddy, his best uh, album there, Three Six Moth, When the Smoke Clears, 
Magic Thuggin. If you guys ain't ever heard this, uh, it's got some good uh, bass to it. And uh, just remember bumping this one too. Yeah, it didn't, didn't last very long. But Snoop Dogg's worst album, The Dog Father. Johnny Cash, 16 biggest hits. This is one I was actually wanting to look for. Easy E, straight off the streets of motherfucking Compton. Twista, Adrenaline Rush. Let's see if that was easy. Right. Slipknot, Iowa. This is just a sampler that I got from a shoe store in the mall a long time ago. Uh, it's got some Foo Fighters and uh, actually had a, what's his name? Eagle Eye Cherry. Uh, what was the name of that song? Save Tonight. Which I still love that song. It was like his only hit, and I don't know what happened to it, but it's a good track. We got Led Zeppelin Presence. Classic Chronic. Dr. Dre. Yeah, it's got my initials on it. A lot of these are from me and my wife. When we first got together, you know, we had a lot of the same CDs and stuff, so I put my initials on them. And, uh, her brother had some. Just, you know who's this, who's Soulfly 3. Spice 1 hits. This is uh, Insane Clown Posse, Mighty Death Pop. And it came with the... Uh, Smothered, covered, and chunked uh, mix uh, cover songs. You got uh, tracks of Fred Durst and Lil White and stuff in here. That's uh, it, it had, uh, if I remember right, you could get it two different ways, but I decided to get it with that one. I forget what the other one was. Red Hot Chili Peppers, Californication. Probably one of my favorite. Uh, albums from them. This is well, in the newest one of this box. This is Lord, pure heroin. You know, it's got the uh, Royals and stuff on there. This is from 2013. That's the newest CD in the box. Then you got Led Zeppelin, Latter Days, Later Days, whatever you want to say. I have the uh, slip that has both bits, both these in there somewhere. It is just a classic rock hits double thing with a bunch of different people on it, and they fall out. Actually, you know what? It might even be a. It's a triple triple disc set. I don't have a lot of uh, classic rock bands, just like ones that I really was into. So I just pick up these packs to hear some other stuff. <sighs> like you care. And then this is a uh, Twisted's Cryptic Collection Volume One. At least some of these ICP twisted albums are kind of hard to find nowadays. But uh, maybe in some of this No Limit shit. I don't know. True, true to the game. It's memories. Uh, that's the case a lot. Is No Limit and Three Six and shit. No Limit Soldiers compilation. We can't be stopped. Even back then, I uh, picked this up for seven bucks. And then we got MTV Presents Return of the Rock, Volume 2. Got some Limp Biscuit, Papa Road, Spine Shank, Disturb, Deftones, Nickelback, Lincoln Park, POD, Head PE, some Manson, Fuel, Godsmack, Orgy. So lots of good bands on there. We got a Hard and Heavy, Volume 1, which I think that's the only one that ever came out. This has some good tracks on it. You guys can find this for cheap. I recommend picking this one up. It's got, um, this Limp Biscuit Counterfeit Lethal Dose Extreme Guitar Mix, that is awesome. And this uh, Rob Zombie Living Dead Girl Naked Exorcism Mix. And Kid Rock and the Bulldog uh, Remix. Those three songs are, are pretty good. And you got some Orange 9mm on here, which you don't hear of too much. And uh, some Sepultura, Machine Head, Fear Factory, Queens of Stone Age, POD, Ministry, Seven Dust, Power Man 5000, uh, Spine Shank, Video Drone. Soulfly, Motorhead, uh, Coal Chamber, 
Lots of good bands on there from back back in that time in the in the nineties, the early two thousands and stuff. And you got Rob Zombie, Sinister to Earth. I don't know, I'm spending too much time on some of these. DMX, flesh flesh of my flesh, blood of my blood. Twista, legit ballin', volume one. It's kinda like a compilation. You got a busy bone, heavens movie. I really like this uh C D as well. I like a lot of their solo stuff. You got the Transplants, first album, you know, with Diamonds and Guns and all that. But uh this whole this whole thing thing's good. Some offspring, XNA on the ombre. Offspring smash. Some of them's kind of in order, I guess. Rage Against the Machine, Evil Empire, love it. Snoop, Murder Was the Case. Green Day, Dookie. Another great album here. That's uh, Verve Pipe, Villains, with the uh, Photograph and the Freshman. Two, two awesome, awesome songs there. You got Slipknot, Subliminal Verses. Another good, good one. You got the Spawn soundtrack, which actually has a few good, a few good tracks on. You got Filter and a Crystal Method. Can you trip like I do? Manly Manson and the Sneaker, Sneaker Pimps. Long road out of, long hard road out of hell. Those those two songs are just awesome. And then uh, you got Corn and the Dust Brothers, Kick the PA, Love That One, and uh, you got some Henry Rollins on here with uh, Goldie. And uh, yeah, it's a good album. Way better than the fucking movie. You got a Blaze of Dead Homie, Colton Grundy. System of a Down, still this album. System of a Down, self titled. Awesome, awesome album there. Psychopathic Riders, Dumping. Good shit. You got a Zug Island, Cracked Tiles. Man, didn't do too much on a Psychopathic, but th this here is really good. If you guys can find this one, I recommend this as well. It's not rap, but really, it's it's more rock. But you got a my least favorite of the uh, crew there, Jump Steady, Master of the Flying Guillotine. So it's okay. The ICP, The Wraith, another one of my favorite of their albums. ICP, The Calm. It's all right. Bone Thugs, The Collection, Volume One. The only little Wayne album I like, The Block Is Hot. Before he got all fucking weird. This is a great, great one here. I wish I could find a real case I had to it. But uh, No Boundaries. It's a benefit uh, album for the refugees there. Um, this has the uh, Pearl Jam song on it. Ah, I forget the name of the song now. But a uh, great, great rendition of that song. Where all these cases are? Sublime, greatest hits. Another another album that I really like when it came out. It's Power Man 5000. Tonight the Stars Revolt. Good, good shit. Seen them live when they first got got popular. You know. You got a uh, laying the Smackdown Project Pat. I know this no kind of order. Boondocks, The Harvest. I like Boondocks. He's probably one of my other favorite uh, psychopathic artists from then. Forgotten Freshness Volume 4. And it came with a Halloween compilation as well. You got uh, Super Villains. Wasn't very good. This is psychopathic as well. Violent J, Wizard of the Hood. It's pretty funny. Uh, any shit on there. <sighs> Forgotten Freshness Volume 3. I thought I just did that one. Oh, sorry, that last one was Volume 4. This is Volume 3. Dark Lotus. Black Rain. I love these Dark Lotus albums. They're, they're pretty good. I like the first one a little bit better, which is right here. This Dark Lotus. Tells from the uh, bleh, Tells from the Lotus Pod. Bush, 16 Stone, 
my favorite Bush album, one of my favorite albums ever. You know, with the come down and all that stuff on it. Audio Slave, Out of Exile. That's a good one. Got a Tool, Lateralis. Great, great album. Godsmack, Awake. I just don't feel like having them. Then you got the other Bizarre with the question marks. The other one had the eyes. I even had to write down the tracks on them because I couldn't remember them. It's hard to read on the back what they are. Awesome. Drowning Pool. Where their lead singer OD. Great, great stuff on here. Center. First guy smack album. I bought this brand new. Drowning Pool. Brand new. Still have Can't get rid of nothing. Isham A1 Yola. Another ICP Hell's Pit. It's pretty good. Twisted Mirror Mirror. ABK, Hatchet History, ICP, Riddle Box. Love their album covers, so. though. Oh. Toxicity, so let's move it down. Very, very good. I don't care what anybody says. If you don't like ICP, I still like their, their album covers and merchandise, all that stuff, you know. ICP, Beverly Kills, 50187. ICP, The Tempest. Another ICP. What is this? Bang, pow, boom. Nah, I don't fucking remember. You can tell I, was, I used to be really, really big into them. It's uh, Blaze Dead Homie. I think that's his first album. Uh, that's, that's really good. Twisted, Mutant, Volume 2. This goes with uh, Man's Myth, Volume 1. I think that Super Villains was uh, Twisted, ICP, Blaze, maybe ABK. I don't, I don't even remember. Uh, Twisted, The Green Book. And last thing out of that box, Cryptic Collection, Volume 2. Right? 2? 2? 2? 2? I don't know. Give me just a second here, guys, and I don't want to have to edit this shit, so. So much stuff in here. I guess I'll at least talk and everything while I'm pulling these out of here. And uh, we'll just keep going. I don't blame you if you turn it off. Or whatever, skim through. I don't care. Oh, these are gonna be like upside down. And everything. I'm just trying to hurry. All right, I got the first uh, layer out of there real quick. All right, continuing on. Rob Zombie, Hellbilly Deluxe, Stone Temple Pilots. Thank you. It's like a best of. Mudvane, LD50. Awesome, awesome. Uh, album there. Stained, Break the Cycle. Good good one there, too. Got a classic Queen. Love Queen. I don't care. Whatever. Puddle Mud, Come Clean. Not only good thing. I don't even know if they did anything else. Uh, the other Queen that goes with that one. So that's Shine Down, very, very good album here. Leave a Whisper has the uh, uh, cover of Simple Man on here and the acoustic version of 45 and a remix of Burning Bright as the uh, bonus tracks. If you guys have never heard their rendition of Simple Man from Leonard Skinner, uh, wow, amazing cover on that. Got a Prodigy, Fat of the Land. Filter, short bus, of course, uh, hit me a nice shot, is on there, the most popular song, Metallica, Ride the Lightning, Avenged Sevenfold, City of Evil, Marilyn Manson, Last Tour on Earth, 
Oh, uh, Brett is taking his out of the box. Cypress Hill, greatest hits from the bong. Corn, take a look in the mirror. See a lot of corn coming up. Soundgarden, A-Sides, great, great album there. Uh, Manson, Portrait, Portrait of an American Family, good shit. Love it. Fear Factory, Remanufacture. I don't have a lot of their stuff, but they're pretty decent. Uh, of course, all-time favorite band ever, Nirvana from the Muddy Banks. Offspring, Americana. Beastie Boys, Hello Nasty. I'm trying to hurry up here. Beastie Boys, License to Ill. System of a Down, Mesmerize. Just throw that anywhere. Time Pieces, Best of Eric Clapton. And just another 70s guitar rock. This is uh, 10 years. Um, the Autumn Effect. Bought this for... What the hell was the name of that song? Wasteland, I think. I think that's what it was. But it's actually pretty good. If you guys uh, can find this for a couple bucks, definitely pick it up. Something still in the wrapper. I don't even know what this is. Anybody? Anybody? Manson, Lunchbox, $3.99. I love the old Manson. I don't know what happened to this. Got all over it. His best album, of course, Antichrist Superstar. I'm gonna have to set that off this right there. Put it spilt on or something. Got a tool undertow. Uh, one of the latter Manson albums. What the fuck was this even called? Eat Me, Drink Me. I don't know. But I, I did like. Uh, I think this has, yeah, If I Was Your Vampire. That's, that's a good track. You got Purpose Circle, emo, Emotion, Head P.E., Broke. That's an awesome band if you guys ain't ever checked them out. It's kind of like a, I don't even know how to explain it. Kind of rap rock, I guess. Uh, Linkin Park, Meteora, Justice for All, Metallica. Lincoln Park, Jay-Z, Collision Course, good shit right there. Cypress Hill, Skull and Bones. Uh, best of Steve Miller. Jimi Hendrix, The Ultimate Experience. White Stripes, Elephant. Corn, Did My Time, Tomb Raider. Uh, heard of the Life soundtrack thing. Just different versions of uh, Did My Time. Another uh, Offspring Conspiracy of One for uh, eight nine nine CD Warehouse. We don't even have any more. Uh, Edema, self-titled. Pretty good. Corn, all mixed up. Just remixes of, uh, what is it? Twist, Got the Life, Good God, Adidas, and then uh, Jingle Balls. Yeah, Green Day, American Idiot. Christian album here. MXPX, Slowly Going the Way of the Buffalo. He used to have a lot of Christian's music. I believe it or not, he used to be really religious back in the day, but <laughs> see how that turned out. But still a good album there. Either way. Got the Best of the Doors double album. Uh, not the biggest Doors fan, but I like some of, some, some of their stuff. John Lennon, Legend. Uh, you know, best of. Of course, you got Madgen on here, which everybody loves. Spine Shank, Strictly Diesel. It came out around the same time as Corn. I'm gonna just get all them. Soundtrack for Scorpion King, which I believe I just bought for I Stand Alone from Yasmack. But you got Rob Zombie on here. Some uh, Creed, System of a Down, Drowning Pool, POD. I mean, POD is a religious band too. But they're okay. Um, Mushroom Head, Coal Chamber, Seven Dust. Another one that's better than the piece of shit fucking movie. But hey, I own three of them. Dave Navarro, Trust No One. Breaking Benjamin. 
Uh, we are not alone. Decent. Disturbed. 10,000 Fist. Favorite album of all time. Hands down. Nirvana. Unplugged in New York. Don't ask me why. Just is. We got another soundtrack here for uh, Light It Up. This actually has a... Uh, yeah. <laughs> me and... My wife's wedding song on here from uh, 112. It's anything. But that's a pretty decent soundtrack as well. You got Insecticide from Nirvana. Man, some of these cases are just trash. I don't know what happened. The uh, Nirvana in Utero. Green Day Insomniac. Stone Temple Pilots core. We're in the room here. I don't know what this is. Let's get Metallica's Black Album. Drew Hill. Self titled. Best of Seven Dust. Soil. If you guys ain't ever heard of them, uh, definitely check them out. They're pretty uh, heavy, not metal, but you know, heavy rock band. And, uh, I really enjoy their music. End of the Drew, Drew Hill. See you on the other side, Corn. Pennywise, Full Circle. Great, great album here. I, I checked out some of their other stuff, and I know, I don't remember who it was, but I mean, some people passed away from this band and everything, but um, another one I recommend uh, checking out if you guys can find this anywhere for a couple of bucks. It's uh, pretty good. It's kind of like Offspring. You got a Head PE, self-titled. Awesome, awesome. Ozzy. What was it? Down to Earth. It was okay. You got a Sublime, Secondhand Smoke. Disturbed, Believe. Probably their best album. Corn Greatest Hits, Volume 1. Fonda, never mind. Marilyn Manson, the Golden Age of Grotesque. Decent. Corn Issues. I know that they had uh, like what was that? Four different covers that came out with this, and I chose this one, and they ended up going with I think the Teddy Bear or something. And uh, yeah, so I'm glad I had this uh, cover here. Really like this. And it's a good uh, album there too. Corn Untouchables. Disturbed, indestructible. Another good corn album, Followed Leader. Hey, there's the other one. Early Days, Led Zeppelin. First corn album I ever heard, Life is Peachy. Good shit. And they're self titled, first album, awesome. 112, Room 112. Blink 182. Take off your pants and jacket. Sorry, I don't remember some of these titles. Apologize. DMX, it's dark and hell is hot. Shadows Fall. The War Within. They're a decent band. Uh, I didn't really hear a whole lot from them. Uh, Transplants, not very good. Haunted Cities. Static X, Machine. I like this album, I don't give a shit. Creed, My Own Prison. Nine Inch Nails with Teeth. Uh, Audio Slave, self titled. Uh, Agro 2000 is a compilation thing. You got some uh, Rom Stein, Duhast on here, Cole Chamber, Loco, um, Henry Rollins, uh, Liar. Very best of Prince. Yep, I own it. And it's been in this box even before he passed, so I didn't just jump on the fucking wagon or whatever. Always been a Prince fan. I don't care. First Nirvana album, Bleach. And Millennium Collection hits, Voice to Men. Right, excuse me, guys. I'm going to have to... Uh, Move some stuff around here, man. It's a long video. 
I commend you if you stuck around for this whole thing. I mean, you ain't gotta watch it all at once. Come back to it. Do whatever. But, uh. Just quit watching. I don't really care. I don't blame it. I'm curious to see what else is in this box myself. So. so, how's everybody doing? Good. It's Memorial Day weekend, Sunday. Just chilling. Going through some CDs here. Reminiscing of good old days. You know, all that good stuff. Sit here on YouTube and watch some jackass go through a CD collection. Alright. There's no organization. Who the fuck buys CDs anymore anyway, man? We're almost to the end, y'all. Sort of. I know. Unsubscribe, right? Whatever. Man, I really forgot. I had some of this stuff, y'all. <sighs> we gonna get done under an hour. All right, best of Pantera. Uh, lots, lots of good tracks on here. You got uh, Cowboys from Hell, Cemetery Gates, Mouth for War, Walk, uh, This Love, I'm Broken, Becoming, Five Minutes Alone, Planet Caravan, Drag the Waters, uh, their uh, cover of Cat Scratch Fever, lots of good stuff on there. Jet, Get Born, uh, Papa Roach, Best, it's good, good one there. Very best of cream. Of course, I uh, had uh, Eric Clapton in there. CKY, answer can be found. Sorry. Uh, smells like children, Marilyn Manson. Coal Chamber, self titled. It's actually pretty good. Uh, 40 Licks, Rolling Stones, best of. First Kid Rock, I don't care what anybody says, this album was fucking awesome when it came out. Uh, History of Rock, Kid Rock. Cocky, Kid Rock. Uh, John Mellencamp, what was this? Uh huh. Self titled, Saliva, another one that was good when it came out. Oh man, I'm missing the CD. Tupac, strictly for my, I ain't gonna say it. Uh, Orin Copper from Live, awesome album. That's why I was opening these though, I can't believe that. Green Day, Nimrod. Video Drone, uh, they did some stuff with Corn, uh, so it was uh, Ty Jonathan Down, Jonathan Davis, Corn. Um, System of a Down, Hypnotize. I miss the CDs. Mystic Styles, 3 6. Spice One. Alicia Keys. Kanye West. Oh, I know why. Some of these are in my wife's uh, CD book. David Banner. Uh, Mississippi. 50 Cent. The Massacre, 
this uh, Tupac, uh, the new mix from uh, some crap they put out after he died. Fraser Boy, Me Being Me. Jay Z, Black Album. Can't have another Black Album. Ludacris, Chicken and Beer. Jenny Wine, Bachelor. This is uh, Me Against the World, Tupac. Most of these two parts thing are in her uh, book thing. Too Short, Chase the Cat, Oasis, What's the Story, Morning Glory. Very good. Ice Cube, War and Peace. Hot Boys. Guerrilla Warfare? Yeah, I think so. Paul Wall, uh, People's Champ. West Side Connection. Game, Untold Story. NWA, Greatest Hits. Uh, Outcast. What is this? Uh, speaker Box, Love Below. This is okay. Too Short, Can't Stay Away. Kanye, um, College Dropout, Project Pat, um, The Appeal, Mixtape, Jay-Z, Dynasty, Pulse Ultra, this is like a free CD, I don't know what the fuck it is, Lenny Kravitz 5, The Prodigy, The Jilted Generation, Music for the Jilted Generation, I was real big on Prodigy there for a while. Uh, Prodigy, Experience, Expanded, Remixes, and B-Sides. P.O.D., Satellite, Taproot, Welcome. Uh, had that song Poem on here. It was alright. Ultimate Bass. Everybody had to use back in the day. Whatever. Motown Legends, Tupac Resurrection, I think it's a soundtrack to that movie or something. Tupac, uh, Till the End of Time, all these aren't even in Machiavelli, Ludacris, um, Red Light District. I think these, well, a lot of these ones here were my wives, but, uh, Shanti, so she has them all in that book. Ludacris, back for the first time. News, compilation, Northeast, Southwest, or West, South, whatever. My Deep, America's Nightmare. Digital Underground, Sex Packets. Flesh and Bone. Thugs, I'm going to say the whole thing. Mo Thugs, Family Scriptures. D'Angelo, Brown Sugar. That's actually nice. Genuine, 100% Genuine. Rome, self-title. Almost done. Another Machiavelli. Ain't neither one of them in there. I don't know what's going on. Hey, I found the case. The two shorts cocktails. Awesome. And then this is another uh, Aaliyah. One of the CDs in there. Uh, I don't even know what this is. Whatever. The case to Aaliyah. One in a million. Tupac, Double Album, Better Days. David Banner. Apocalypse Now. Mm -hmm. Bone Thugs, East 1999, Eternal. Probably one of their best uh, albums there. Uh, too Short. It's, uh, it's like a compilation thing. Jay-Z, The Blueprint, uh, 
two. Another case to only guy can judge me. I think it's just a case. Yeah, I don't know what to... Warren G, take a look over your shoulder. A full blooded Memorial Day. Of course, he was on a no limit back in the day. Tupac, are you still down? 3 6, most known, unknown. Destiny's Child. Yin Yang Twins, United States of Atlanta. Mo Thugs, uh, Family Scriptures. I think that everyone's volume two on that. And, uh, Mia X, Mama Drama, from No Limit. Ludicrous, uh, Word of Mouth, Foxy Brown, China Doll. Z, Hard Knock Life, Volume 2. And the soundtrack next Friday. Uh, Memphis Bleak, I'm getting down to it's like the bullshit now. Uh, Alicia Keys, Diary of Alicia Keys. Oh God, really? Mike Jones. And then uh, Snoop Dogg, Rhythm and Gangsta. And then uh, What You Gonna Do, Link. I don't know what the hell that is. Alright, so, that's it. Made it under an hour. Holy shit. Awesome. Well, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of me unboxing the... Uh, my CD collection, and uh, if you made it through, congratulations, I commend you, I was long and uh, tiring, so, so if you guys uh, have any of these albums or are interested in knowing more about them, um, I couldn't really think too well just going through them, um, definitely feel free to ask me my opinion on them and everything, if you guys still uh, even buy CDs anymore, but um, sorry for all the uh, Delays and everything. I say I just don't want to edit this, and it just takes too long. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And this will probably be the only thing I do. It's not movie related, um, but who knows? And uh, thank you guys for watching, and definitely give it a thumbs up if you like it or dislike it. I don't care. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time, and we'll be. I promise we'll be back to movies later.